This video is about the error, error your IP address is denied access. Uh, so you will get this error when you have an email server with um, DNS blacklisting. So <clears throat> in my case, I have the mail enable uh, machine. And in the mail able, in the enable machine, you have here in your uh, in your pop um, connectors, uh, pop services. These are the services which are active when you connect with a email client to the uh, to the web server uh, to the email server. Then, when you go there to the properties, and uh, there you will find an access control. And when you click on there and default, you will have uh, this granted access. So it says by default, all computers will be granted access. So when I close this and run my machine again, uh, in the background here, and when I test it again, then you will see the machine runs perfect. So <clears throat> there's another problem. Uh, which we which you will find when you have this um, machine and when you watch on your uh, on your uh, pop debug logging then you will see there are a lot of uh, a lot of machines try to hack your machine so in this case as you see there was a machine coming in and tried to uh, hack the machine so because there is no Wolfgang, Wolf, Wolf, you see this wisdom, they try uh, through hours to hack your, uh, to get access to machine and then they take the, ac the, ac the account. So <clears throat> for this point you have to uh, to lock your machine and in my case I have for example uh, my machines are here this is my this is my from the Microsoft account and when you are there you will say okay you deny everything and then you you accept, uh, you accept something except those listed below will say okay this is accept all uh, 40 numbers which are in general the uh, Microsoft account and you have to access uh, when you go to your web browser and say, okay, what is my uh, my IP? You will have something there. When you check this, you will see this is my uh, the telecom account in Germany, for example. So when you log, when you search for your own IP on your machine, which is in the internet, uh, then you will see in this case that's, that's my seventy nine. 79 circle so by this when I close it and start that stuff again when I now uh, synchronize again then also the stuff was allowed because I reduced the circle to a smaller account when you go to the Outlook <clears throat> Outlook uh, account on the internet <clears throat> then Microsoft checks all that stuff with the account of 40 so this when, when you come with this machine this is the IP address uh, area of 40 and 32 and all that stuff you have to find up you, you have to look up all your as you see those are the 40 IP 40 block and this will go on you have to go through all those uh, debug blocks and have to look up what with what with which uh, address areas your uh, providers will come in um, and so you may reduce the spamming and hacking on your machine